And also, don't tap the side of the, you're tapping the side of the component without tapping the board. If, that's why the solder is never making its way down to the board. So you want to, let's, let's say this is the component and this is the pad. Mm -hmm. You don't want to tap, you're not tapping this because then this is never going to get hot and the solder is never going to stick to it. The solder is going to go to whatever's hot. So you want to have the, uh, the knife tip touch the point between the capacitor, the oh, component, okay. and the pad. Okay. If you keep tapping this, this is never going to get hot and the solder is going to keep climbing gotcha. like it is there. So clean all the excess solder off of your tip with this. And put, put your tweezer in, on the brown part of the capacitor in the middle and just to pin it down to the board so that the board, neither the board nor the capacitor move. Yeah, so I would put your tweezer and just tap right there and, and press down. And now use the iron the way I said and have it tapping, have the iron press the pad on the board. And also not that long. That's the, you, you, like a, 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 you know, an eighth of a second max. Okay. It, each time you do a tap, it should be an eighth of a second. Now, you, don't, you don't need to keep it there for three or four seconds. And now clean the excess solder because you have too much on there. Do it again. Eighth of a second. Same now with a clean, Yeah, same one. Just like literally eighth, maybe a sixteenth of a second. Bam. Okay. Now you see how there's less excess solder? Now, yes. cl now clean the tip. And do that about three or four times very quickly until you don't have that pile of excess solder there. Also, even though you're only touching it for an eight, a sixth of a second or an eighteenth of a second, you still want to do it a nice hard press. And there you go. You see, you see how the solder is now encapsulating the component, yes. but you could st there's not a mound of it, and you could still see the top of the component clearly. That's a good joint. Okay. You don't have that, and you don't have that Hershey's Kiss nonsense going on because of the flux.